The animal kingdom can be pretty unforgiving, and if you mess with the wrong opponent there's no telling the damage they will deal with, and while we love animals, here on the stunning 5 channels, we also love a good animal versus animal battle. Now and again, of course, pitting them against each other in large areas is a bit excessive, but in a more natural setting where animals fight for food mates or to protect their cubs, it becomes less dangerous and quite unpredictable to watch. Welcome back to Stunning 5 where today, we're going to look at 6 amazing and unusual animal attacks on other animals, but before we start we want to know who do you think would win in a fight? A rabbit or a snake sticks around to the end for the answer. Number 6. Possum vs Monitor Lizard Monitor lizards are large lizards with long necks, powerful tails and claws and strong limbs. Adults can grow to over 10 feet in some cases, and many of them are carnivorous eating eggs of other reptiles and small mammals. Among other things, they also make for agile climbers, and this lizard has spotted its lunch a baby possum in its nest. The mother sees the lizard approach, and there's a moment where they're both frozen. They both look ready to attack. The mother circles the tree to warn away the lizard, making a loud noise that forces it to retreat not to be deterred. Though, the lizard climbs back up again, it gets quite close too close. In fact, it takes a chance and pounces right into the nest straight for the baby, and it probably doesn't even realize the grip. The possum is on its tail. The battle ensues, but what we don't see is that the lizard has already devoured the baby possums in the nest. The mother has lost this fight, and the lizard slips away after having had his meal. Before we move on, here's a quick challenge for you. If you can leave a like on this video smash that subscribe button and turn on the notifications in less than 5 seconds, you will have 10 years of amazing luck. Hurry up and try it. It actually works. Number 5, Wolf Pack vs Polar Bear. Two apex predators in the Canadian Arctic face off against each other, but one of them has backup. The Arctic wolf or white wolf is a medium-sized subspecies of the gray wolf and native to the Queen Elizabeth Islands of Canada. They typically roam in packs, which could mean bad news for this polar bear, but it's also the polar bear's migration path. It will either have to learn to share or fight over this coastline. It seems the wolves pick the latter. They are known to hunt polar bears and harass them. This one goes straight for a bear that appears to be enjoying a nap. If they manage to catch this bear, it'll feed the pack for a week at 1,500 pounds and with a bite force of 1,200 psi. Nobody dares approach them or challenge them, that is excluding this wolf. The bear seems to be up to the challenge and confronts the wolf head-on, but there are more of them. The bear seems to run calculations in his head before deciding to go for it. Number 4, Water Buffalo vs Lion. Imagine you're having a meal at your dinner table, when out of nowhere you find yourself flipped 5 meters into the air. Well that's what happened with this poor line, as it was having its afternoon snack. A water buffalo this duo had been stalking their prey for 45 minutes waiting for the perfect opportunity to pounce. The king of the jungle was just about to complete a kill when a giant male buffalo intervened and flipped the lion 5 meters into the air. He goes to flip him again and this time the lion knows not to mess around and makes a run for it. It's no easy feat. Keep in mind that lions can easily weigh up to 550 pounds, and let's not forget their agile quick predators. The buffalo may be heavier, clocking in at 2000 pounds, but it's nowhere near as agile, but when your friend is in danger. Number 3, Leopard vs Porcupine. It would take a truly desperate predator to resort to tackling a porcupine for food. In case you didn't know, the only place you can get a bite out of a porcupine is its underbelly, which one could argue is a tad challenging to get to given all those spikes. On their bodies, most porcupines are about 60 to 90 centimeters long with their spikes anywhere between 43 and 75 centimeters depending on the species. They are round little things and relatively slow, so no match for the speed of a wildcat, but their strategy of defense is a postmatic, which means they advertise to predators that they are not worth attacking or eating along with raising their quills. Porcupines also clatter their teeth as a warning noise to let predators know not to come any closer. Porcupine's tail is also able to swing in the direction of the predator. If contact is made, the quills could be impaled into the predator causing injury or death. Nevertheless, the leopard tries to paw the porcupine looking for a way to flip it over and expose the underbelly. The sharp quills can easily snap off and become embedded in flesh. Number 2, Komodo Dragon vs Monkey. These dragons are the largest extent species of lizards growing up to 10 feet in length, and they dominate the ecosystem they live in. Found on Indonesia's Komodo Island, these guys hunt and ambush anything that moves from invertebrates to birds and mammals. Their group behavior while hunting is exceptional in the reptile world, and they are also known to attack humans. In this case, an unfortunate monkey becomes the prey of this massive lizard and is chowed down in the blink of an eye while still alive. You could see the monkey struggling for a while before finally giving up. After eating about 80 of their body 
body weight. These dragons usually drag themselves to a sunny location to speed up digestion, since the food can rot and poison it. Number 1, Lioness vs Hyenas. It's unclear what provoked these hyenas to attack in the way they did, but this lone lioness standing on tall grass seemed to be minding her own business when the entire pack pounced on her the lion struggles desperately to get away, but more and more hyenas joined in. In the bullying at one point, there are so many of them you could barely even see the lioness. Luckily, her friend comes to her, rescue and pounces on one of the hyenas, sending a few of them running more lines coming in and giving chase. While many of the hyenas do the smart things and clear off, some come back to issue a challenge. There's a before a few growls send the remaining hyenas packing. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.